Good morning, Gilchrist Grizzlies, and welcome to Grizzly AM, your morning news show. I'm Jenna. And I'm Jaden. Today is Friday, September 14, 2018. Please stand for the morning pledge. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the news. Two more Grizzly readers have read five Sunshine State books. Congratulations to Laurie and Addison. They have picked their prizes and have their pictures on the Wall of Fame. Great reading! Today is International Dot Day. We will be celebrating all day in the Media Center. This fun celebration is based on the book, The Dot by Peter Reynolds. It encourages all of us to make our mark, and we can do so by starting with just a dot. Happy Dot Day! Now it is time for our PBIS winners from fifth grade. Good morning, Grizzlies. Today we will celebrate our fifth grade winners who were caught being respectful, responsible, safe, and being a team player. So without further ado, let's congratulate our winners. Gianna from Miss Barry's class, Kaylee from Miss Bryant's class, Sarah Elizabeth from Miss Gray's class, Rowan from Miss Irving's class, Tyler from Mr. Kitten's class, Quentin from Miss Rankin's class, and Jackson from Miss Rue's class, and Taylor from Miss Sims' class. Uh, I also want to say that y'all have done a great job this week following our grizzly expectations. Uh, today, we want to talk a little bit about being safe. We have a big school with lots of kids here and lots of teachers, so we'll make sure that we are walking through the hall, staying on our right side of the hall so we're not bumping into each other. Uh, we do love to read, read, read. We want to make sure that book is not in front of our face. We want to pull it down so we can see it. I want you guys to have a great weekend. Thank you, Ms. Stevenson. Check out our Grizzly Weather Station. We have a current temperature of 75 degrees and a projected high of 94 degrees. There is a 0% chance for rain. And now, for, it, now it's time for the Pittsburgh's Corner with Mr. Crow. Well, good morning, Grizzlies. We've had another great week here at Gilchrist, and I want to thank you for making it such a great week. And uh, I've seen a lot of people wearing their red today or their uh, kind of college football jerseys and different things like that for Spirit Day today and the red for Gilchrist. So it's a, it's a great Friday already, and it's time for our Friday funny. And let's see what uh, our joke of the day is going to be for this week. Our special one is from Jenna who's in Mr. Kenton's class. And uh, all right, let's see what our joke of the week is. Why don't you give Elsa a balloon? You've all seen the movie Frozen, so the question is, why don't you give Elsa a balloon? Come over here, guys. We're going to tell everybody together. One, two, three. Because she will let it go. Let it go. That's why you don't give Elsa a balloon. She might let it go. All right, let's have a great day. Read, read, read. Thank you, Mr. Crow. Our thought for today is from Peter Reynolds, author of The Dot. Creativity is not an option. It is essential. Please join us again Monday for another edition of Grizzly Am. Have a great weekend. Bye. Bye.